Hi, and welcome to another be weekly buzz with me, Mrs. Busby. This week we're going to be talking about convergent boundaries. Now in plate tectonics, we say that plates are sliding around. They're moving towards each other, they're moving away from each other. When they move towards each other, they collide. That creates a convergent boundary. When plates collide. Now, convergent boundaries can create different landforms. Today we're going to be talking about oceanic versus continental. So let's add our water and label oceanic. Continental. Notice that the oceanic crust is a lot thinner. It's a lot thinner, but it's a lot denser, which means that there's more particles packed into it. It's heavier. And that's going to be really important. So in our picture, this plate is moving this direction. And this plate is moving this direction. Now when they hit, the heavier oceanic plate is going to sink under the continental plate. We call this subduction. So it sinks down into the asthenosphere. Now once here, it begins to heat up and melt. Now this process is actually kind of complicated. It involves ocean water and the amount of material in it, blah, 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 yada, yada, yada. It melts. And when it melts, it makes magma. Red hot magma. And that magma is going to begin to rise. And it's going to find all these nice little cracks and crannies in the continental crust. And it's going to come up to the surface of the earth. And it's going to make volcanoes. Volcanic mountain ranges. We have volcanic mountain ranges all over the earth. We find them in the, and, in the uh, Andes down in South America, the Cascadia mountain range here in America, uh, several others that I just can't think of right now. Now, this process happens also if oceanic crust hits oceanic crust because one will sink under the needs and they will make volcano mountain ranges, in this case volcanic islands. We call it a volcanic island arc. But this process happens when oceanic hits continental or oceanic hits oceanic. Either way, the important thing to remember is that the oceanic crust sub ducks into the asthenosphere, melting and rising up to make volcanic mountain ranges. This has been another weekly buzz with me, Mrs. Busby.